Me da mucho gusto saludar a Ren Charan, que es uno de los destacados consultores internacionales que asesora empresas tales como General Electric, Ford, Dupont, Universal Studios, entre otros. Y por supuesto nos da mucho gusto tenerlo acá para hablar con él, autor de 25 libros eh, muy interesantes sobre temas empresariales. Y vamos a hablar inicialmente, Charán, con la bienvenida sobre la invitación que usted nos hace para entrar en la era de la mentalidad del cambio. Change is going to be continuing. It's an exponential change, sometimes linear change. And some change is the unstoppable trends. First and the most important, anything that can be digitized will be digitized. Almost all people in the world will be online in a way they are today. Google, Baidu in China, Facebook, Amazon, Alibaba in China. This is the greatest driver of change. It is changing companies, it's changing habits, it's changing people's aspirations. Ram, ¿y cuál es el papel de nosotros, de las personas que estamos dentro de las áreas de negocios, de tecnología, dentro de las empresas, para sacar el máximo provecho de esa digitalización? Es una gran oportunidad para el negocio. Hay muchos, muchos ejemplos donde la gente ha pensado en una nueva necesidad. Y tienen dos o cuatro personas juntos. Y ellos desarrollan una plataforma y una app. Y ellos crean un nuevo negocio. We should take that as a friend, we should take that as an enabler, and we should say, what is the consumer new need? How do we make it cheaper, faster, and make it more convenient for the customer? Dentro de su conferencia en la cumbre de liderazgo de Huobi, usted habló sobre la forma de tramitar, de gestionar la energía para hacerlo de manera eficiente. Qué importante que nos comparta ese concepto para nuestros televidentes. In any group of people, There are people who create energy, and there are people who drain energy. In any of these groups, it's usually one or two people who are toxic, who create unnecessary competition. They go behind the back. You, as a leader, should deal with that issue. Then there are those who create energy. They are always looking for new ideas. They experiment, sometimes they fail. They stimulate new ideas with the others. Find those people, create new energy. Mind has no limitations. And there the brain is plastic. This is what creates the exponential progress. También Ram mencionó como una de las claves del liderazgo el hecho de acompañarse de gente que inclusive sea mejor que los líderes que hay en la compañía. Eso es una invitación a tener un muy buen equipo de trabajo. Qué bueno que nos amplíe ese concepto. The secret of leadership success is proven over thousands of years. Leaders are humble and they find and search those people who are better than themselves. They know they don't know everything. People who are better than them raise the bar. These are the people who create more capability, more capacity. And this way, you are able to grow exponentially. Ram, ¿cuál es la mejor manera de tener una buena cultura organizacional al interior de la compañía? A culture is behaviors. Behaviors are emulated by most people whose behaviors get emulated is the top CEO and possibly another 20 people. So culture is what the 20 people set. Their behavior, their questions, their ability to do reviews, their ability to promote the right people sets the culture. Whenever a company gets in trouble, culture in trouble, the board brings outside people and they usually change the top 10, top 20 people. They don't change the whole company. And so culture is collaboration behavior. 
innovation behavior and you do coaching and take toxic people out. Ram, estamos en una cuarta revolución industrial y nos parece muy importante que usted nos dé algunas recomendaciones prácticas de cómo eh, comportarse dentro de esa nueva forma de hacer las cosas. ¿Qué debo tener en cuenta? ¿Qué hacer y qué no hacer? I think we are not in the post-industrial revolution. It is a big mistake. We are in the services revolution. Every single product over time is going to be a service product. All the things we do, Google, Apple, Amazon, they are services. Industrial part of it as a percentage of GDP is declining. In America, it's declining precipitously. So we are in a service, digitally driven services, customer experience revolution. People who brand it post-industrial, I disagree with them because the total industrial production as a percent of GDP is declining. Muchísimas gracias a Ram por estar con nosotros y además por compartirnos esos, eh, esas ideas tan interesantes para el mundo empresarial y los negocios. Mil gracias. Thank you. I'm delighted to be here. It's a great country.